Hi, I am at Pool at Tram Station to visit the most famous and very big flea market in Belgium's capital city, Brussels. This is the world's only flea market that is open 365 days a year. These tiny cobblestone leaves lead us to the market. Did you know, cobblestone is also considered as Belgian heritage treasure just like Belgian beer, cheese and chocolates. After walking for 7 to 8 minutes, you get your first glimpse of the market from far. This market was established in 17th century and moved to its current location in 1854. This was intended to be a play field for handball initially, hence it was named as Place du Jardabal which literally means place to play the ball. However, this place was always utilized for the market and never for ball practice. The crowd here is a mix of interior designers, decorators, artists, book lovers, art lovers, antique enthusiasts and the collectors. The place is also hot favorite amongst the tourists and the locals who are also genuine buyers hunting for some cheap bargains for day-to-day -day living. And of course the photographers and vloggers like me. The pieces are displayed on blankets, carpets or on small and large tables. Few art pieces are even strewn around the trees, giving this place a more rustic look. There is a huge collection of different kind of paintings almost everywhere. Similarly, porcelain, ceramic and glass crockery can be found at most of the stalls. The collection here makes it a very lively and interesting place even for just a casual stroll. Everyone has something to take away, may it be crystals, semi-precious stones or these lovely beach figurines which you may want to take home as a memento of Belgian summer. Some stalls sell junk and some are dedicated to only one specific type of treasure. From antiques of 19th century to fabric, from vintage car models to the forgotten dialing phones, from lampshades to the spectacles, this market does not disappoint even the music lovers. It has infinite boxes full of DVDs, vinyl records. The vendors are relaxed, friendly and not at all pushy. They let you browse through the collection at your own pace. Except for few, most of them understand only French. This market is a mix of junk to some rare classic antiques. So being patient is the only key. If you want to find a real gem, you need to literally dig into the boxes and scan the tables till you are satisfied with your treasure hunt. It's the 2 o'clock church bell and I have finished my treasure hunt. After this mind-boggling excursion, you certainly want to relax at one of these lovely little cafes around the market. The famous Belgian mussels are on the top of the menu. To add to the charm of the old market, I found this music band playing some cheerful music making my lunch just the perfect. I hope you enjoyed this quick check of the Brussels flea market and will definitely add it on your next trip to Brussels. Do like, share and subscribe Mamta's Pavilion for more of such online culture trips. Thanks and bye!